The circumstances around the arrest of the late Nelson Mandela back in 1962 have always remained murky. But now for the first time we have a CIA operative, the late Donald Rickard, who admits that he was the man that tipped the South African police off. Uh, this is uh, something that's basically confirmed suspicions that have been swirling around South Africa for many, many decades. And you have to remember the context. This was Cold War politics. Back in 1960, the ANC, the resistance movement, had been banned. Nelson Mandela led the armed wing of that resistance movement. He'd received military training in Algeria in 1962 and was arrested just a few months later. Now, this uh, CIA operative said he didn't regret what he did. He said at the time, Nelson Mandela was considered the most dangerous communist outside of the Soviet Union, although Nelson Mandela always maintained that he was never a member of the Communist Party. So what does this mean today? Well, it's likely to put more pressure on the CIA to try and release more documents relating to that time. There have been pressures, freedom of information requests to try and obtain that information, and it's managed to resist that so far. The African National Congress, the government of South Africa today, well, a spokesman today said he wasn't surprised that this CIA operative had been named. And he said that he believed that there were still members of the CIA meddling in South African politics today because he said they want regime change.